I ain't gonna lie. Charleston is a unique place. We got a lot of churches. We got a lot of people. The great Denmark VC tried to free his people. He had a plan. But somebody told him. Hell, they got so scared they had to build a, a, a military uh, arsenal, weapons arsenal. They call it the Citadel. A lot of death, a lot of pain. We got streets named after racist slave owners. They dead, but the mindset is still here. John C. Calhoun, we call him Killer Calhoun. They call Charleston the Holy City. I don't know. <laughs> That's interesting, but... Sometimes I think it's just full of holes. The oldest commercial building is a tavern, a liquor store. That's right. But the big money maker was the slave trade. They're proud of firing those shots in Fort Sumter that started the Civil War. They romanticize it. They love it. They romanticize the Confederacy. Second place, they love it. <laughs> they love the houses built by black hands. They used to sell us in the street. And then they said, oh, that's too much. We got to sell them inside. But they were still selling and making money and breeding them. On the plantation, they would make bricks. Here's a handprint from a small child or enslaved child. And I got to shake hands with the ancestors. That's an awesome feeling. I got goosebumps. We create sweet grass baskets with black hands. Here we got alternative facts being told on these tours. And they love to say Charleston strong. But with all these disparities, it feels like a Band-Aid on a bullet wound. 